The Royals have made it clear the team is leaving the Truman Sports Complex. And leaders in independence say the city will be dealt a blow to its economy. The biggest impact will be to our businesses uh, and the, the folks that run them. The Royals are considering two sites, one in North Kansas City and one in the East Village. But leaving Kaufman behind has consequences. An economic study conducted for Independence found the city will lose about $7.5 million in annual economic activity. Tonight, KSHB 41 News reporter Caroline Hogan is amplifying the voices of those who will be directly impacted by the Royals leaving, which include businesses just minutes away from Kaufman Stadium. Jesse Stenner comes to Dixon's famous chili for one thing and one thing only. Oh, you can eat tacos for sure. Like others, it's been his go-to spot since he was a kid. Oh, it's a nice atmosphere. It's uh, kind of traditional. Uh, it's been around for a long time. It's just uh, kind of a family, family store. But during Royals season, it's a different story. During game day, uh, I try to avoid it after that. Like if you come in here before a game, it's pretty much all blue or over half blue. A Royals move will impact the city of Independence. A recent study estimates a $7.5 million loss a year. Steffes says Royals fans account for up to 10% of Dixon's annual sales. I have tons of people I know and friends that it's a tradition for them to come here and then go to the Royals game. I dread what our summers will look like without the Royals. Steffes hopes his family's business can stay in the game. We're only eight minutes from downtown, so my hope is that it'll still be some part of people's tradition. It's going to stay a part of Stenner's tradition, Royals or not. Oh yeah, as long as it's open, I take my kids here. In Independence, Caroline Hogan, KSHB 41 News.